Hi, here is a few steps to set up your Qfield application to work with Walker RTK receiver. The first thing is go to settings, Bluetooth and do pair your smartphone with a receiver. Please check that your receiver turn it on. Ok, here it is. Please use pin code 1234 for this. Ok, we have saved device Walker RTK. It's done. The next step is installing of the software Lefebure and Trip client. So, on the second step, you have to install this application. And again, we go back to the settings. And now we have to activate uh, developer mode. We go on to about phone and tap a few times, maybe 10 times on the version of the software. Ok, you are now a developer. Ok. Now we go to the additional settings. And we have developer options. Select mock location application. We choose Lefebure and Trip client. After that, we go to Ntrip client and tap settings. Display settings we don't change, receiver settings we use. External via Bluetooth, Bluetooth device, Walker RTK, Bluetooth connection method insecure, and other settings as you can see here. And the main setting is Ntrip settings. Here you have to choose Ntrip protocol, we use Ntrip Revision 1. In the field Caster IP you have to enter your car's network credentials. This is your subscription data and access to corrections network. You can get it from your network supplier. It can be an IP address or server address. The next field is Caster port which you also can get from your supplier as well as your login and password to access the network. At last you have to choose mount point in the data stream field. Now we can go to the main menu of the Ntrip client and push the connect button. After that the program will create two connections at once. First connection with the server to get corrections. Second is Bluetooth connection with the RTK receiver. We can see a successful connection to the server and receiver and there is a data stream that is displayed in yellow. We see data bytes. And finally we enter the Qfield application. It did not change the position in settings. Here we have it set to internal device and that is the way it should be. We have the entry client running in the background and while it's running we receive corrections for our receiver. Ok, we have RTK fixed and in the Qfield program we see the accuracy parameters of the horizontal error 12 mm and the vertical error of 20 mm. Now you can do your serving works with high precision. If you want to stop it, you just close Qfield application and stop the Ntrip client. You have to stop Ntrip client because if you will leave opened connection with the server, it will continue using your data plan of internet of your device. Thank you for watching of this tutorial. 